Hello, welcome to the Weber Dojo. Today we're going to do a kumite drill. We're going to use a long distance kumite drill. So when you are sparring with a partner, you have a short distance, medium distance, and long distance. And your response to that, you use either shifting or sliding in a short position. You can use a short step um, for medium distance. For long distance, you want to make a complete step backwards or a complete step forward. So that's what we're going to be working on today is a step forward and a step back. So we're going to do this kumite drill using it like a one step uh, type drill. So for beginner and intermediate, I want you to use a basic stance, meaning a basic front stance, uh, back stance, kibidach, the stances that you know. For the advanced, you can use a freestyle stance. You can begin from freestyle. Uh, of course, once you launch your attack, at the end of your attack, you have to be in a basic stance. And then when you're blocking, counterattacking, you need to be in a basic stance as well. And then you can recover back into freestyle, okay? So then um, for black belts, I want you to assume that the one technique that we're working on when we're attacking is the attack in a combination that requires your response to it. So in the example that we usually give, we usually give the free sparring example of stepping, punching, front kicking, and then counter punching. So in this drill, we're going to use, say, the, the kick. That's what you're responding to in this drill. So we're just going to make it a one attack idea for you to um, use your block and your counter with. So make sure that when you're doing this, I'll coach you along the way, that you are making a step forward and a step back. I don't want you to be using just shifting your yashi and things like that. I want to make it complete long distance as best we can. So make sure that you've warmed yourself up before we begin. We're going to perform this drill step, making one step forward and one step back. So it'll look like this. So beginners, you're going to start from basic stance, beginner, intermediate. I want you to start from a front stance. And then as you're stepping forward, most of the attacks you're going to land in a front stance anyway. So make a complete front stance here. For advanced level, which is brown and black belts, you can start from freestyle. Make sure that after your attack is completed, you have to make a front stance or a correct stance. And then you can recover back to freestyle. And then the attack is forward, straight in. I'm going to go directly towards the camera. So if you can go directly towards the camera, that would be helpful as well. And then you're going to make one step back. So now you can step straight back or you can make some sort of adjustment by using an angle, rotating around using an angle. What I want is I want you to keep this left side forward for this part of the drill so that we're ready to go again with our left side forward for the next attack. Okay. So from here, we're going to do three attacks for each um, technique. So the first one, for instance, will be Oizuki Jodon. All right, so step back with your right leg, down block. Now, I'll go from freestyle. Everybody else, assume your position. So you're gonna announce Oizuki Jodon. Okay, that's punching face. Ready? Step forward, Oizuki Jodon. Each. Hold the attack, one, two, then, Advanced people can recover. Uh, beginner, intermediate, stay. Then you're going to step backwards and you're going to block that same attack that you just made. So if it's Oizuki Jodon, that means when you step back, I want you to defend against somebody stepping towards you with their right foot and making Oizuki Jodon. Okay, so two. Here's an example. Block, punch, one, two then recover. So when I say recover, I want you to get back to your line, facing directly towards the TV, and making sure that you're ready for the next one, okay? You can change your block, you can change your stances, you can change your counterattacks. I prefer that you use a single counterattack. You can use a combination of counterattacks. That's fine with me. It's not a requirement to just use one. But again, I want you to have your left side forward when we, when we recover back to here. Okay, so let's try again. So it's still the same target, which is step and punch face. Two, hold it for a count of two, 
one, two. Advanced people can recover. Then you're gonna go the other way. You're gonna step backwards for the same attack. Ready? Two. And recover. Third one, ki on the attack and then ki on your counterattack. Ready? So this one should, once you've done, you've already done the, this drill two times, third one, this should be regular speed. Ready? Ready? Go! Up! And then step backs the same. Go! Up! And then recover. Okay, our next target and technique is Oizuki Chudon. All right, so from here, Oizuki Chudon. One. Hold it for a count of two. Recover. Now you're going to defend against Oizuki Chudon. So you want to imagine the person's coming at you. So they're stepping forward with this side. The punch is coming from this side of the body. Ready? Each step back. Block counter. Then recover back to your position. Remember to hold your technique. At the end, for advanced people, hold your basic stance for a count of two, then you, you, you can recover. All right, second count, Oizuki Chudon. Knee! Now, defense side. Knee! And recover. One last time, go regular speed. Now backwards, go, up, and recover. Okay, the next attack is Maigeri Chudon. So back leg, front kick, stomach level. All right, ready? Each, and recover back to freestyle. Then stepping back, you're gonna block against that same front kick. Knee, and recover. Okay, front kick again, shoot on level. Itch, and then defense. Knee, up, and recover. Last one, this one should be regular speed. Ki on the attack, Ki on your counterattack. Son, up! And defense. Son, up! And recover. Okay, next attack is Yoko Gary Kikomi. So you want to make sure that after you throw your kick, that you land in a front stance. There's, you don't have any resistance today, so it's gonna be easy to make a front stance. When you're actually with a partner, they're gonna be pushing your leg by blocking it, so they're gonna be pushing you one direction or the other. So fighting for your front stance is gonna be more difficult. So I want you to set a good habit by making a front stance after your side thrust kick. All right, so ready? Side thrust kick. Each. And recover. Okay, so now, you're gonna imagine that that right leg is kicking you. So when that right leg is kicking you, you wanna imagine where the toe side is. So I'm gonna switch positions just for a second, just so that you know uh, where we are. So if we started out here, left side forward, defense side is also left side forward. So when they step back to block, they're gonna be stepping back, their right side is gonna be forward. Okay, so then when they kick, they're going to be kicking with their left leg, making the kick this way. So if you can see, my toes are this way, my heel is this way. So it's my recommendation that you go to the, you block to this side. Okay. So when the attack comes, you want to make sure to be in this direction. But again, remember, I said I want you to make complete distance. I want you to make a complete step. All right. So stepping back, Yoko Gary Kikomi. Ready? Each and recover. Ready? 
knee. Okay, stepping back. Knee. And last one. Sun. And last time. Sun. And recover. Okay, the last attack is going to be Mawashigari. So roundhouse kick, let's go Jodan level, since we've already had three Chudan level attacks, and we've only had one Jodan level. So roundhouse kick, Jodan, and then step forward into a front stance. Ready? Itch! And recover. So now they're going to be kicking, if we use the same formula, their left leg was forward, they stepped back, they're going to be kicking with their left leg. So when they kick, Mawashigari, the kick is going to develop in this direction here. It's my recommendation that you go to this side over here, okay? You don't want to meet any part of the kick for this direction, all right? So from here, let's see, we're here, you're going to want to go this way, okay? Ready? Itch! And recover. Okay, let's go again. Knee! And then defense side. Knee! Recover. Last time, Ki on the attack, Ki on the counter attack. Sun! And defense side. Sun! Up! And recover. Okay, relax. Do what your body needs. If you need to stretch your hamstrings, um, work out your knees, your ankles. Now we're gonna change our legs. So you're gonna have your right side forward, make down block and then advanced people you can recover into freestyle position. So we're gonna do those exact same attacks three times each. First attack is Oizuki Jodan. Ready? Each. Hold for a count of two, and then recover back to freestyle. Now remember, the attack is coming uh, from that same left leg stepping forward and punching. So you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you block that technique. Ready? Each. And recover and reset. Ready? Same thing. Each. Recover. Knee. Up. And recover. Last one. Ki on the attack. Ki on the counter attack. Each. Up. And last. Last time. Okay, next attack is Oizuki Chudan. So imagine that you're stepping in with your, okay, so you're stepping in with your left side, step forward, Oizuki Chudan. Each! And then recover. So then on defense side, they're stepping in and punching. Ready? Knee! And recover. Ready? Attack again. Knee! Recover, and then stepping back, knee, and recover. All right, last one, sun, up, and last defense, sun, up, and recover. Okay, next attack is my Gary Chudan. Right, front kick, chewed on level. Itch! So now they're attacking, stepping, or stepping in with front kick. Knee! And recover. Knee! 
and then defense. Knee! Last one. Some! And last time. Some! And recover back to your position. All right, next attack is Yoko Gary Kakomi Chudan. So let's go through this again. You're kicking with your left leg. So you're gonna step forward, land in a front stance, okay? So let's do that part, ready? Itch! Okay, so now for your defense side, I'm gonna switch a little bit. So we're gonna imagine that the person that you're kicking had their right leg forward as well. When they stepped back to block, they stepped back, they had the right leg stepping back. That means that they're gonna be kicking with their right leg here. You can see my toes are this way, my heel is that way. So that's the direction I wanna go. So from here, when I'm in position here, I'm gonna to wanna to go this direction, okay? Ready? Knee! And recover, reset back to position. Itch! Knee. Recover. Last time. Sun. Up. And last one. Sun. Up. And recover and reset. Okay, last attack is Mawashigari Jodan. So back leg roundhouse kick. Itch. Okay, let's go through this again so you know which direction you're going to move when you step back. So assuming that your defender, your partner, has their right leg forward, they're going to be stepping back this way, which means that their right leg is going to be back. So that's the leg that they're kicking with. So when they kick, the arc comes in this direction. I suggest you don't be there. I suggest you go this way, okay? So after our attack here, we're gonna wanna go this way for the roundhouse kick. All right, you ready? Each and recover. Ready? Me! And then backwards. And recover. Last one. Yeah. Hey. And then defense. Sun. Hey. And recover. Okay. And stand up. All right. The final drill is for you to rewind this video and watch all of the videos again and all the attacks again. But this time as i'm in my uh, attacking position you're going to be the defense so that we're going to virtually be sparring so when i announce oizuki jodan you're going to defend against oizuki jodan then when you when i defend against oizuki jodan that's when you attack so you would attack oizuki jodan i would make my block my counter attack for oizuki jodan so watch this video again assuming that position, and then we will be able to virtually spar. Of course, I'm not there in person, so I cannot offer corrections. I can't watch what you're doing to help you. So I really am relying on you to work to perfect your own technique. All right, thank you. Have a good day.